Benjamin Strücker, Berlin Institute of Health. Generation of a tissue-engineered neopancreas. Good afternoon, everybody, and thank you very much for the invitation. As we already heard today, diabetes is a global epidemic and a grow pro growing problem. And although there are available therapies, all of those implicate uh, several issues like uh, secondary diseases, immunosuppression, or pancreatitis in case of transplantation. The technique of tissue decellularization and recellularization might help us to overcome these issues. As you can see in the video here on the top left, during decellularization of red pancreata, cells and antigenic material is removed from organs and only the extracellular matrix is conserved. This matrix is less immunogenic and conserves the microanatomy of the organ and thus can be used for the repopulation with cells from a different origin. So, to translate this concept into a clinical setting, our idea is the following. We want to take a skin biopsy from a patient suffering from diabetes. We will reprogram the cells into um, uh, induced pluripotent stromal cells. Then we want to differentiate those cells into insulin producing beta cells and finally repopulate a decellularized porcine pancreas with those cells to generate a new pancreas. This new pancreas will be implanted into the same patient and the big advantage of this concept is that this patient will not need immunosuppression nor can he suffer from pancreatitis. Here are some of our first results from the small animal model. As you can see, we constructed a bioreactor for the ex vivo perfusion of red pancreata. We used this setting to decellularize uh, red pancreata and uh, we isolated um, islets from, from different animals and repopulated those matrices with those islets. As you can see in the tunnel staining, those islets are viable and they are functional after the process. Due to the fact, um, you can start the video please. Due to the fact that um, the surgical handling of the pancreata is quite difficult. We moved on with our technique and we are now using red livers for the, uh, for the technique. We are decellularizing red livers, as you can see in the video. We are repopulating them with islets, so we are constructing a new pancreas from a liver. Then we are repopulating the vascular system with endothelial cells. And finally, we are implanting those constructs into diabetic rats to cure diabetes in a small animal model. Then we're planning to scale up the concept into a porcine model because this will be the prerequisite for a clinical translation. Thank you very much for your attention.